Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to my tutorial on what are the dots for. What we'll be talking about is the fret markers on guitars, or the dots. Now sometimes we don't have dots. Now there are different types of fret markers out there. You might see dots, like the ones you see here, or you might see some other types of markers. Like these, which are bar markers. Here's another type of marker. Here's some that are moon-shaped. These are diamond shaped. Here is yet another shape. Here's one where the dots are off center. Now even though dot markers may appear to be different, they all represent the same thing. As you may notice, there's a dot at the odd fret on the neck up until we get to fret 9. 3, 5, 7, 9, and then we have 12, which is an even number. Then we go up to 15, 17, 19, and 21, and that's on a 21 fret guitar. These dots represent a different point in the major scale on each respective string. Let's use the E major scale as an example. The E major scale is E, F sharp, G sharp, A, B, C sharp, D, and then we have again E. Looking at the E major scale, the open fret is the E note, or the one note of the key. The first dot represents the flat third of the key, which is G. The second dot represents the fourth of the key, which is A. The third dot represents the fifth of the key, which is B. The fourth dot represents the sixth of the key which would be C sharp in this case. The twelfth fret, which has two dots, represents the octave. We're back at E again. Now when we get high up on the neck, we'll have fret number 15, which is the same as 3, fret number 17, which is the same as 5, fret number 19, which is the same as 7, and fret number 21, which is the same as fret 9. So this note is E. Then we have G, A, B, C sharp. The same as we had down here. G, A, B, C sharp. And then our octave again open, octave, 12th fret. Now this is the same for every string on the guitar. If we go to the A string, the open string is the one note. Fret three, or the first dot, is the flat third. And that would be C. The fifth fret, or the second dot, would be the fourth of the key, or D, and so on. We have the fourth, the fifth, and the fifth would be an E in that key. And that works for every single string on this guitar. This particular guitar has 24 frets, so we see the double dots twice. So we have the octave twice. We're going to have E here, and then we'll have E again way up here. This guitar only has markers up to fret 19. And this guitar only has markers in two places, one at the 5th fret and then one at the 12th fret. 
Even though there are less frets and less markers, they still represent the same degree in the scale. And that's the story on what the dots are for. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.